Hello. Today I'm here with more Balloons Tower Defense because I got an update. Oh! What? Oh! Oh! I understand how this map works. So, this is the new map that just got added called 1 2 Tree. I understand how it works now. So, this was opened on the first round. This is on the second. This will be whenever I finish third, right? If it... Oh, I get to... This is... This map is broken! Yeah, this map is broken! Because anything placed in here gets a discount! That is actually... That is so good! I don't know what this and this does, but... As long as I have a discount in jungle drums, I'm fine with it! more jungle drums. Now I understand why this is a beginner map. Wait, shouldn't seven have already opened? Wait, shouldn't seven have already opened? Or do I need to fill out these as well? Hold on. I can't even place anything down here. Oh, yes, I can. It's just very specific. Hold on, let's place a druid? I'll place a druid there. And then engineer here. And then if I really need to, I'll place a glue down there. Now, oh no, it still doesn't work. Okay, now I'm confused about the map again. Oh! There it goes. There it goes. Are you kidding me? This is... This is a real map! I love this map! I was gonna go for more Gla or Glaive Lord. They just nerfed it. So it doesn't have infinite pierce with its spinning glaives. I don't know if that's worth it anymore. I like this map. Yeah, I like the map. Hold on, do I need to click the present? No, I don't. Okay. That's something I should have learned a while back, but I'm fine with learning it now. I was confused about how this works, but I'm starting to understand it, and I really like this idea. I really, really like this map, just because... This is something we've never seen before in any Balloons Tower Defense game. And now it's one of the made. Now it's one of the main maps that is going to be played a lot right now. As soon as the new boss comes out, expect me to try and beat it. Because I've been looking at it. Wait a second. This has to be a demo for, like, to, for you to understand. Because. The boss. I forget what it's called. But anyways. It will create a shield and it will be immune to certain monkeys. Like it will can be it can be immune to magic, support, military, primary, and all those. So this has to be like a template to tell you that that's going to happen because I can place a super monkey here, but not here. That has to be the reason why. 
so players understand so they can get used to it before it actually drops. Because it hasn't actually dropped yet. I can't play the new boss yet. That was my whole idea. I hopped on to Balloon Tower Defense. I'm like, I'm going to play the new boss. Oh, wait, it's not even out yet. But I'm really excited for this new boss. I don't know about the... What is it? Beast Handler? I'm not all that excited about it. It sounds like a good idea, but I feel like it's just going to be Dartling Gunner. You'll have one good use, and that's against bosses, and that's basically it. You didn't knock him back, Boomerang. I'm going to try and uh, chimps this by the time Christmas it actually comes. Just because this is a Christmas themed map, might as well. Chimps isn't actually all that hard. Oh yeah, I just remembered. Druida the jungle got nerfed, but jungle's bounty got buffed. So, Druida the jungle. It has, instead of having 30 pierce, it has 20. But jungle's bounty, instead of having 30, has 40. So, you gotta take what you can get. And that actually gives jungle's bounty a better reason to exist. Other than a pathway to getting Spirit of the Forest. Speaking of Spirit of the Forest, there he is. He's right there on the icon. I feel like I've got this. I don't think anything can get through. And even if they can, what are they gonna do? Just wait for glue? It might be better for me to go for Glue Storm for the extra damage. Because the thing is, he's so far back, he's not going to get used all that much. Oh yeah, I also learned there's just a hotkey for pausing and not just escape a bunch of times. Hold on, I want to see... Wait, they did change it. Or no, it has discount. Never mind. Never mind, it's the same. Because I was going to say, if they changed it, Glue Storm is actually the cheaper, uh, cheapest tier 5. But no, it's still tied between Ultra Jug and uh, Glue Storm. Which, fun fact, Ultra Jug is actually cheaper than Glue Storm. Because Spike, yeah, Spike Opult and Juggernaut... Do not add up to 3,000, where Glue Hose itself is 3,000. Fun little trivia for you. Yes, I agree with that. Because there's no way that we're going to lose. Does that just mean extra pierce? Wait, hold on. What happens on 25? Because there is no 25. Oh no. Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? I don't want to leave and rejoin. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Can I fit another one? No, can I place it so close? I'm not gonna sell it. Uh, that was close. Hold on. Um. Never mind. Because there is basically no room except for down here. Or right there. Well, actually, I can place it right here. Try and find out what that does. Embrittlement. Boop. The mighty yes, the mighty have fell. They have fallen down the stairs. I 
I am so glad that this game actually goes fast compared to the first person one. Because I was playing the first person Balloons Tower Defense. And no, it's not like an official thing, it's a fan game. Anyways, I was playing it. Holy crap, that game is so boring in like round 40 and above. Because of how absolutely long it takes to pop a MOAD. Because I was. I was contemplating playing it as a video, but then as soon as I got to round 40, I'm like, because I wanted to beat it at least once to see if it was good. As soon as I got to round 40, I'm like, no, that is not happening. I don't know how I could have made it entertaining, because I, I, even I was bored just playing the game. The only thing we have to worry about now is camo lead. It's not that big of an issue, but I'm still scared about it. Hold on, what does this one have? Jungle drums. Hey, jungle drums good for shimmer. I don't think it's good for shimmer. I don't think it's good for shimmer. Because the thing is, Shimmer's not going to be doing much damage anyways. An enemy red from battle. <laughs> he is Dr. Octopi. Best round. Wait a second, does it go the whole way up to around 100? I like that this is just my whole, like, line of defense. This is kind of like hedges in a way, except it's easier than hedges, because the trees fall down. Okay, that's fierce, I'm guessing. This is jungle drums. We're gonna have to learn what all these are. I'm guessing... Where is it? No. I'm, yeah. I'm guessing this just means it does extra damage. That's obviously jungle drums. That does more damage. This is discount, which I really like. That that's just a thing you can get now. Oh, you can... Oh, you can click on the arrow and then see... Oh, okay, okay, okay. I like that. But you can't click on... Okay, you can't click on that, though. Yeah, 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 I like this. So that... Yeah, that's extra damage for sure. That's definitely extra here. That's just jungle drums and then... No, it's over here. Yeah. But I like that there's now a native... Monkey business. Hold on. Ow. That, I was just... I was reading it because I never use it to begin with. And I was just confused. Okay, what does this give? Discount. And then... Hopping. Oh, and that's why the signs are up here. So it tells you what is happening. Oh. I thought it was saying that primary goes in this lane, magic goes in this lane, military in this lane, and support in this lane. And then the two middle lanes are just free spaces. But no, I understand this map now. This is a really ingenious map. I'm probably not using that word correctly. And if I'm not, I'm just meaning... This is really smart. Whoever designed this map, I give props to you. Actually, no, I am 100% using that word correctly. Because ingenious just means, like, it's very simplistic, and yet you manage to make it work, or something like that. Close enough. I'm not the Nazi of grammar. This one looks like a troll. 
My brain is slowly turning off because, as you can tell by me wording it like that, I am not good I am or Nazi, though. Anyways, I'm going into free play. I want to see if... Wait a second. <laughs> uh, it's been a long day. That's my excuse today. I was just going to say, I'm going to go into free play. I want to see if the rest of the trees will fall. Do you see any trees? Except for up here. Do you see any trees? Because I think they're all down. <sighs> Anyways, and I'm if I sound like tired, I'm not doing this just because I have to, and it's like, oh, I'm tired, I don't want to do this. I'm doing this because I love it, I love doing this is my dream if you want to if you want to ever be a youtuber i'm going to give you one hint only do it if you actually want to follow that path don't do it if you're like oh i can just play free games and then make money from it because that's not how that works you need to be determined to make videos or else no one will watch you That's just my tip advice. But anyways, if you liked watching this new map, comment, share this with your friends, maybe like the video. Honestly, I don't really care about likes, but if you dislike the video, I will find where you live and I will steal your phone or whatever you're watching this on now and I will select like. I won't do anything at your house except for that. Because I want my likes and no dislikes. But anyways, this is the end of the video. See ya tomorrow with hopefully another video of Balloons Tower Defense. Bye.